citizens is that time you're officially in alert zone welcome to the alert zone tv <clears throat> i am the wizard uncle james uh i would love for you to become an active citizen you can do that by hitting the subscribe button hitting the bell so you can notify when we drop fire content giving the video a like sharing let me just get right into it because it's cold as shit out here we love to talk about when shit hit the fan we always think about the zombie apocalypse and things like that. We don't understand that weather events are part of shit hitting the fan. Right now in Marshalltown, Iowa, it's about five below zero. We got about a foot and a half of snow on the ground. I just got finished shoveling and salting. And this was the perfect time to talk to everybody out there about the proper clothing. Let me tell you what I mean by proper clothing. Every household in this country should have rubber boots in. When I say by rubber boots, I mean something like these. Um, these are insulated rubber boots uh, for the Midwest and for hunting and things like that. They're insulated. But even if you live in the South in Hurricane Alley, rubber boots is essential and I'm going to tell you why. People think that it's got to be freezing cold for hypothermia to set in. If your feet get wet, and you get cold hypothermia can set in in the summertime and kill you. I got the all weather uh, waterproof jacket. I got the pants. I got a suit on under here plus thermals. And I have on thermal socks. And these gloves are insulated gloves for working in sub zero temperatures, like in freezers and stuff. And I just wanted to talk to everybody. And if you don't believe that the proper clothing, it's really important and shit hit the fan. Think about this. For everybody who play Call of Duty and Battlefield and all the rest of this stuff, ask yourself one question. Nine times out of ten, why do these guys and girls always have long sleeves on and rubber boots? Even though it's a video game, it's still simulating. You gotta have proper clothing. So one thing about having too much clothes, you can take them off if it's warm. And you can put them back on if it's cold. But if you don't have enough clothes and the cold set in, you can forget it. So, uh, this is not going to be a very long video. But this is a shit hit the fan. Get you some rubber boots in your house. And, whew, as you guys can see, the camera's starting to already get full of snow. From the blowing snow. So, get you some rubber boots. If you live in the Midwest... Hell, right now across the country, we got this polar vortex going on. Everybody needs to have extra blankets, extra everything. Because if you live in Texas, remember, last year, the year before, it got so cold, y'all had that blackout out there, and a lot of people was freezing. A lot of people got sick because they didn't have proper clothing. Don't ever let your guard down and think that shit hit the fan is just a zombie apocalypse, or it's just hide the firearms. You got to have proper clothing, too. A lot of us don't understand how much the weather takes a lot of people out because a lot of people catch pneumonia and other types of diseases from freezing and they fight them and they never get rid of them. So until next time, everybody out there, stay safe, stay armed, stay on high, high alert. Remember, you get the fan and it's cold as shit out here. Peace.